Acceleration at the head of the peloton. Two fourth category climbs will give the riders a bit of work out. Fighters will surely take advantage and try to escape. The breakaway has 30 seconds lead. The first climb of the day is classified as fourth category. There will be one point that goes towards the mountain standings. The front of the race is two kilometers from the summit. Watch out, you'll soon have no more energy to attack. One and a half minutes for the breakaway. It might just work. Here's the positions over the last climb. Fabio Aru is an excellent climber, capable of playing a leading role on the Grand Tours. He already has two podiums on the Tour of Italy and one victory on the Tour of Spain. A mountain bike specialist, Alexis Vuillermoz made a successful switch to the road as evidenced by his stage win in Mur de Bretagne on the 2015 Tour de France. The time gap between the peloton and the escapees is stationary. His best chance of victory is to try a break away from far out.
the best placed in the overall standings amongst those at the head of the race. His teammates are riding hard. He must find the situation dangerous with so many riders who've broken away. The peloton is starting to ride behind you. It looks like he doesn't want yet another rider at the head of the race. The next difficulty is listed as a Category 4. Reduce speed a bit, otherwise you'll hit the wall. Teammates are riding hard. He must find the situation dangerous with so many riders who've broken away. At ease on short climbs, Mountain passes are on the flat. All he lacks is a good turn of speed when finishing in a big group. He's an excellent puncher who also knows how to climb in the mountains. On the other hand, it's better for him that he finishes alone because his capabilities as a sprinter really are limited. Allez, les gars, courage Allez, les gars 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 Allez, les g
¡Vamos, chicos! ¡Muy bien! ¡Venga, prepara un poco más! ¡Muy bueno! ¡Vamos, amigos! ¡Muy bueno! ¡Venga! ¡Venga, dadle ahí! ¡Dadle ahí! ¡Vamos, campeona! ¡Vamos, chicos! ¡Vamos, campeones! He's the best placed in the overall standings amongst those at the head of the race. His teammates are riding hard. He must find the situation dangerous with so many riders who've broken away. Good puncher and tireless attacker, Tim Vellens is a rider who never throws in the towel. Eso es, chaval. Venga, apretad un poco más. You must constantly try to shelter from the wind so as not to consume energy. This is what allows a rider to edge clear at the end of the race. The tempo is increasing at the head of the race. The breakaway riders will try and manage the time gap. When going downhill, the aerodynamic position is useful to increase speed without expending energy. The head of the race has one and a half minutes lead on the yellow jersey. Guys, don't forget to protect our leader. Communication is important. That's why we have Team Com. Although his list of achievements lack depth, Diego Rosa is a very good climber and whom his leaders can count without worry. The yellow jersey group is one minute from the head of the race. Muy bien, muy bien. Vamos, campeones. Eso, 
Change at the top of the provisional general standings. The leader's team will have to make its mark. Virtually taken the white jersey from us. The intermediate sprint will be fought out in Bagnères de Bigorre. The sprinters will no doubt try to pick up some points before getting together to create the gruppetto. Riders have reached the intermediate sprint. It doesn't seem to be a good day for him. He's being distanced. Here's the winner of the intermediate sprint. That's good enough, lads. There's no way we can lose the green jersey today. It's good. Apretad un poco más. Venga, apretad un poco más. Muy bueno. ¡Vamos, Venga, apretad un poco más. Venga, chavales. Venga, chavales. Venga, chavales. Venga, chavales. The Tourmalet will be climbed on its eastern side. The climb via Saint Marie de Compa is a little over 17 kilometers. The beginning is quite easy, but after four kilometers, the slope regularly exceeds 10%.
First riders are beginning the ascent of the Tourmalet. If in the first five kilometers after Saint-Marie de Campan the percentages are fairly reasonable, the rest of the ascent is far more demanding because the slope hardly drops below 8%. A relentless climb. The yellow jersey group is one minute from the head of the race. Another acceleration. Change at the top of the provisional general standings. The leader's team will have to make its mark. The men at the front are now onto the steep slopes of the Tourmalet. The head of the race has one and a half minutes lead on the yellow jersey. Oh, 
Another 10 kilometers before the summit of the Tourmalade. The gap isn't changing much. The front of the race is approaching the La Mongie Ski Resort. They will soon be less than five kilometers from the summit. Vamos chicos, muy bien. Venga, 
There will be 20 points for the first rider over the top of the Tourmalet. Reduce speed a bit, otherwise you'll hit the wall. from the summit. from a few hairpin bends have been negotiated at the start, the descent of the Tourmalé presents no major risks. Climb a standing. The advance of the lead group should be enough to carry it to the end. His team is riding for the overall standing. The front of the race will struggle to widen the gap.
chicos, ánimo. The time gap with the head of the race isn't changing, lads. The peloton is riding hard. Stay well placed. The lead riders, one minute thirty on the favourites. The gap is one minute between the favourites and the guy in the front. Watch out! You'll soon have no more energy to attack. The lead rider has 30 seconds on the favourites. I don't know if it's a bluff, but the breakaway looks to be increasing the pace at the front of the race. Allez, 
It's an irregular climb. Alternating between gentle slopes and steep ramps, it will force riders into frequent changes of tempo. For now, it's the virtual yellow jersey. You seem to be running on empty. Lift your foot if you don't want to blow up. The winner in Autocom will pocket 10 more points for the mountains classification. He takes the virtual lead of the overall standing. Only five kilometers left for the race leader.
less than three kilometers from the finish, no one has managed to gain the upper hand. If no one attacks, it will be decided in the sprint. A teammate has just been dropped. You can't count on him any longer. Only two kilometers left for the lead riders. No one has yet gained an advantage over his rivals. This should come down to a sprint. The advance of the lead group should be enough to carry it to the end. The leading men will soon be under the red pennant. Who will come out on top today? The breakaway is one kilometer from the finishing line.
A few minutes ago, he was first across the finishing line. Here is today's stage winner, Guillaume Martin. Congratulations to him. He really was the strongest. He fully deserves this prestigious victory. He's amongst the leading riders of this year. Here is the yellow jersey of this stage. Let's hope for his sake that things go as well in the future, but for now he can relish the moment. We can say that everything is going well for him at the moment. Here is the green jersey of this stage. Let's hope for his sake that things go as well in the future, but for now he can relish the moment. He tops the standings and will receive the traditional honors. Here is the polka dot jersey of this stage. Let's hope for his sake that things go as well in the future, but for now he can relish the moment. He tops the standings and will receive the traditional honors. Here is the white jersey of this stage. Let's hope for his sake that things go as well in the future. But for now, he can relish the moment.